Today is Saturday, September 25th. Last night, I started working on the letter mill. My husband was kind enough to buy me some yellow ink. So, finally arrived after a really, really long time. There were shipping conflictions. <laughs> so, it took a while to get the yellow ink, created the envelopes, and those are finally done. It took a little while, but it's done. So, today, we are going to be making some little memo note sheets that are going to go with the letter set and then after that i need to make the little stickers that are going to go with them as well mr someone is mostly done because he already has like a sticky note so i'm just going to add five of those into the set and then five for all the other ones with their own design let's get started on making those sheets and making the stickers for the letter paper set
Last night I finally finished putting all the envelopes in the little loose leaf papers and figure out the stickers and it took a really really long time actually to figure these stickers out even though I've already created the stickers beforehand it just figure out the format and figure out how I wanted each of them to look like and just finalizing everything over here is a Mr. Sun set that is fully finished a full set has eight pieces of letter paper and I'm thinking for now maybe I'll give customers the option to get sheets with no lines we'll try that for now and see how it goes the standard set will have eight pieces of letter paper and you can choose ones with lines or no lines it comes with four envelopes here is the back and here is the front with the flap the inside of the envelope doesn't have any sticky strips so you will have to use a glue stick or something to keep the envelope closed when you send it it comes with six loose leaf papers that are three by three you can use these to write a note to yourself or a reminder and these are the four stickers that I chose for this set of letter paper. If you buy the standard letter paper set, you get two of these for a total of eight stickers. Now I'm also gonna offer a mini set. The mini set will come with half of how many things there are. I think that's a good option to have. At first I thought I wanted it all together like this if you buy the standard size, but then I figured that it would just be smarter to go ahead and cut them down to two little mini sheets that way if someone orders the mini letter set then i don't have to go through the trouble of trying to cut this in half this is the back of the sunflower here's the front and i think this envelope is probably one of my favorite envelopes here's the back and here's the other side it's the back of the sunny junior envelope this is the other side this is also one of my favorites i really like how the border scalloped borders look like here is the rainbow envelope and here is the other side action really like this design too this is the only envelope that doesn't have rounded corners because at the corners they're squared here so if I wanted to make it rounded and not look weird I would have to round this corner off so I just decided to leave it these took a really long time to do but I'm really happy with how they turned out overall not bad Pack up my summer in a Ziploc bag Old maps and tchotchkes, photographs of this and that I'll write myself a letter so that I'll remember all What if I don't hold on to this red string? Can't retrace my old steps, the songs I used to sing If the birds all eat my breadcrumbs, how will I know who I was? Call me the sentimental type, nostalgic, but I have to prove that I was here What if I forget that I was here? I can't forget that I was here Boxes on boxes you'd call worthless stuff But I get a glow each time I go open it up If memory's a treasure, I'm trying to be a billionaire I fear I'd fall apart to lose The things that form my heart that prove that I was here What if I forget that I was here Someday all the people that I love will move on Someday all the places that I love will be gone Someday I might not have my brain to rely upon Oh, so what happens then? How will I go back to Get that.
so it is saturday october 9th it's been a while since i vlogged or spoke to the camera been very busy with french class we have a big powerpoint presentation that we had to create and organize i watched squid games with my husband and it's very very good i've seen that all over tiktok and i finally decided to watch it and yeah it's pretty good so if you haven't watched squid games and if you kind of like that kind of stuff then i highly suggest it it's the biggest thing right now got a few things for my shop canada post mailboard that you see when you go to the counters and stuff that you can use to see if your packages are too big or too small to go as letter mail or oversized letter mail and that's going to be a really really big help for me in general if you have a small business account with canada post you can buy that from their shop for about 15 canadian so if you have a little bit of extra funds to get that then i highly suggest you get one it's very very useful and finally having the official thing will keep my mind more at ease when i go drop the item off at the post office not too long ago i opened some vinyl that it's just vinyl that you can lay on top of sticker paper before i tried hot laminating my stickers but i didn't like how thick and how stiff it made my stickers feel so i'm going to try the vinyl i bought if i like the vinyl i want to cut them down to the size of paper so i can lay them on top of stickers whenever i cut them so i will have to try that eventually but it will probably won't be this week so this weekend is a three-day weekend because thanksgiving in canada is on monday so we have that day off so i want to make use of this weekend as much as possible one of the things i really want to do is finish the bare stationery items so i designed the envelope and the stickers i'm done coloring the stickers and i'm almost done coloring the envelope design so i'm going to finish that today hopefully prep and prepare and organize that and eventually hopefully get those letter paper items into the shop over here on my crafting table my other letter paper sets with their envelopes and their stickers have been sitting there for like a week or so plus and they're starting to have a little bit of dust on it <laughs> but i just really haven't had the time to go over there and organize them because i'm trying to finish the bare stationery honestly having the ipad and being able to draw while i'm not at home has been a really 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 big help most of the time i only have time to draw in the mornings right before french class but thanks to that i can even organize like my thoughts and actually work on art while i'm at school i know for a fact if i didn't have that then i definitely wouldn't get any artwork done i'm at school i'm at my desk for what six plus hours when i come home i don't want to be at my desk here drawing it's like i've been at the desk the entire day and i don't want to do that usually i'm exhausted when i get back home i'm hungry usually when i get home that we have to start dinner very soon so there's not even that much time to just rest <laughs> before i have to do something else i can only imagine what i would be doing like i probably wouldn't even be able to vlog if i didn't have the ipad because i wouldn't have anything to show here are the stickers for the bear stationery and I'm really happy with how they look like. I'm still kind of playing around with the brushes that's available on Procreate. Try to figure out what brushes are the closest to the ones that I use in Fire Paca. Overall, I'm really happy with the design of that and how it turned out. Here is the envelope design. I'm almost done with it. Now I'm working on these little white shines on the berries. So I need to put that on all the berries and then i'll be done with that part then on the other side here i have to finish this beehive and this little bee because these will be on the other side of the envelope at the bottom so let's get started on that Desolate, do you take a stand? 
The October 10th, and I finally finished all the letter paper, the envelopes, the stickers, and all the little loose leaf papers. This project has been pretty huge. I'm so happy that I finally finished them. In the next year vlog, I will share some new projects that I will be working on, and I'm really, really excited to start on that. So, if you guys would like to have a little sneak peek, you can follow me on Instagram where you will see what I'm working on there. I don't post all the time on Instagram, but whenever I do have something to share, I usually have it in my stories. That has to be done before the winter art or the winter stuff. So I'm a little worried about that because usually I like to have winter stuff out like a month and a half or so early. For me, it's kind of cutting close to that. Especially since I don't have as much time to work on my vlogs and draw art. Hopefully it'll go okay and I can still work on winter stuff, but I can't guarantee anything at this point. Hopefully I can get the letter paper sets up soon. I would love to have them up probably sometime within the next week or two. So I'm going to end the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.